Hi guys, welcome back to Cards TV. This is Mary, and it's time for another fun sketch over at Paper Play Sketches. And today we're going to use sketch number 31. I really like this one. It's simple, but you can add so much to it and just make this your own. And here's the card that I made using Paper Play Sketch number 31. I think it turned out really cute. I love all the blues and then that little pop of black. And I love this little Betsy Bluebell. This is an image from Penny Black. I love Penny Black stamps. She's got Betsy Bluebell and Mimi and lots of cute, fun little furry animals. But let me show you or tell you what I used to make my card. Now for the plaid paper, I used... Lawn Fawn Perfectly Plaid. I love this one. It's got beautiful pastels in there. And for my black and white polka dot, I use this Doodlebug Design 6x6 six six paper pad. And this is called Craft in Color. Now, I stamped Betsy Bluebell using Memento Tuxedo Black Ink. And I colored her with my Spectrum Noir Markers. And to get the best results when you use the Spectrum Noir markers, you want to use the Spectrum Noir cardstock. This came with my set of Spectrum Noirs when I ordered them from HSN a while back. And it blends beautifully, guys. And you can also pick that up at Amazon. But I did the different colors using my Spectrum Noir, and I'm going to use my next video to show you how I colored her and shaded everything, and I also used uh, a wink of Stella on the balloons and the little hearts. I just think she's so stinking cute. But we'll do the next video, and we'll do the coloring and put this card together so you can see how it all went together. But for my rectangle, like you see here on the sketch, I used my Cricut Elegant Edges cartridge and that cartridge has that shape on page 51 and this is my little uh, sky paper with the blue background and the white clouds and then this was my black shadow. Now this little sky paper is some that I've got saved in my computer. It's uh, I bought a digital set of Echo Park paper, and I think this one is called Walk in the Park, something like that. I'll have it at the end of the video for you. But I just save it, and I can print out whatever size I want, and I've got it all the time now. I love having that. And then for my little cloud up here with my sentiment, I used the Create a Critter cartridge, and on page 52... There's this little cloud, and I cut my cloud at an inch and a half, and I cut my elegant edges shapes at three and a half. Now, after I colored uh, Betsy Bluebell, and let me show you that little stamp set. It's just too cute, guys. There it is, and there's lots of different ones on here. She's holding a bouquet of flowers, packages, and this one's really cute for spring where she's watering some daffodils, and there's little tiny bees and all kinds of things. I love that little set. But after I got her colored, I used my brother's scan and cut to cut her out. You can fussy cut her if you're good at that. But I'll also, in the next video, show you how I used my brother's scan and cut for cutting her out. It was super simple. And I've got her popped up on some foam tape. Now, for my sentiment, I used the Cards TV It's All Good stamp set. And we've got You Lift Me Up, because she's just floating up in the sky with her balloons. I thought that was really cute. And there it is right there. We've got several others on here that I could have used, but I really like that with those balloons. So there we have it, guys. There's my card using Paper Play Sketch number 31. Be sure and come over to the blog paperplaysketches.blogspot.com and take the challenge with the skies. This is a fun sketch, and I know you can come up with some awesome cards. So come and visit us. 
Thank you so much for coming by today, guys. I appreciate all of you, and I will see you again soon with another card. Bye now.